The Bombardment of Kagoshima of 1863. The Bombardment of Kagoshima, also known as the Anglo-Satsuma War, was fought between Britain and the Satsuma Domain, Kyushu, from 15th to 17th August 1863. The British were trying to get compensation and justice from the daimyo, or lord of the Satsuma Domain, for the Namamugi incident in 1862. That was when ships of the Royal Navy were fired on from coastal batteries near Kagoshima. The British bombarded the city in retaliation and pushed back the Satsuma, but were unable to defeat them and retreated two days later. The Satsuma declared victory and, after negotiation, also gave in to the British demands for the Namamugi incident. On September 14, 1862, the Namamugi incident happened when a British merchant, Charles Lennox Richardson, was murdered by samurai of the Lord of the Satsuma Domain. It was said that Richardson didn't stop respectfully for the father of the daimyo and his retinue while traveling on a road near Kawasaki. He was immediately killed under the right of samurai toward people of the lower class for disrespect. Richardson's death outraged Europeans as a violation of the extraterritoriality they had under the unequal treaties. British Lieutenant Colonel Edward St. John Neal, the leader of the British government people in Japan, demanded an apology and a huge amount of money. 100,000 pounds, which was equal to one-third of the total revenues of the Bakfu, which is the Shogunate government, for one year. Neil threatened to bombard Edo, now Tokyo, which was the Tokugawa capital city. Britain also demanded that the Satsuma lord arrest and put on trial the samurai who murdered Richardson. 25,000 pounds compensation was also demanded for the survivors of Richardson's group and his surviving family members. Trying to avoid more trouble with the European powers, the money was paid on July 2nd, 1863. The Satsuma refused to apologize and pay the extra 25,000 pounds for compensation. They also refused to arrest the two samurai who did the murder, as they demanded that it was their right to execute people who showed disrespect. This argument was inv invalid due to the unequal treaties. Japanese laws of respect did not apply to foreigners. Satsuma also felt the pressure of the anti-foreigner feeling in Japan at the time. The British wanted to make a point over the anti-foreigner attacks, happening in many places throughout the country. This was due to the Emperor Komei's 1863 order to expel barbarians. The European powers decided to act with force. The battles in Shimonoseki then happened. The Western powers were successful and shipping through the area was safe again. Further negotiations with the Satsuma for over a year were not successful. The British government and Admiral Neil were ordered to act. The Tokugawa government wanted to delay action. On receipt of your dispatch of the 3rd August, we fully understand that you intend to go within three days to the territory of the Prince of Satsuma, with the men of war now lying in the Bay of Yokohama, to demand satisfaction for the murder of a British merchant on the Tokaido last year. But owing to the present unsettled state of affairs in our empire, which you witness and hear of, we are in great trouble and intend to carry out several plans. Supposing now something untoward were to happen, then all the trouble both you and I have taken would have been in vain and fruitless. Therefore, we request 
that the said departure may be delayed for the present, which is August 4th, a message by four ministers of the Shogunate Foreign Affairs. On the 5th, a top minister visited Lieutenant Colonel Neal, but instead changed positions and offered a steamer warship to join the British squadron. The ship didn't join the squadron, though. The British squadron left Yokohama on August 6th. It composed of seven warships. They anchored in Kinko Bay on August 11th, 1863, near Kagoshima. Satsuma envoys came out to the flagship, and the British commander demanded the terms be met in 24 hours. The Satsuma clan made excuses and didn't comply. The deadline expired, so the Royal Navy commander seized three foreign-built steam merchant ships worth about 128 million pounds in modern British money that belonged to the Satsuma. They were to be used as bargaining tools. A typhoon started, and the Satsuma chose that time to start firing on the British ships. Surprised by the hostility, the British fleet responded by first pillaging and then setting fire to the three captured ships. This actually angered the British sailors because they wanted the prize money. It took them two hours to get ready to fire back, since they did not expect to have to fire at the Satsuma. They formed a line of battle which sailed along the coast of Kagoshima and fired back. The smallest British ship set five Okinawan trading junks on fire. The naval bombardment killed only five people of the Satsuma since they had already evacuated the coastal areas. Thirteen British sailors were killed, including the captain of the flagship and his second-in-command. They were both beheaded by the same cannonball. Over 500 wooden houses were burned in Kagoshima, which was about 5% of the city. The Okinawan embassy was burned. The Satsuma forces were pushed back. The British were not expecting to have to fight, so they were running low on food and ammunition. So they had to retreat. It saved face for the Satsuma, and they claimed a victory. The British did not land troops or seize cannons. The British Admiral Cooper just decided that enough was enough. Satsuma, however, later negotiated and paid the £25,000 that was requested in the first place. They borrowed the money from the shogunate, which they never paid back. They never turned over Richardson's killers, though. The deal was still enough to get an agreement by Britain to supply steam warships to Satsuma. The conflict actually started a close relationship between Satsuma and Britain, and they became major allies during the Boshin War. Thomas Blake Glover supplied the Satsuma with much of their weapons. These are mini rifles that he supplied and a Smith & Wesson Army number no. 2 that he supplied. 